players are. So, I mean, Zamba needs no introduction. The man, the myth, the legend. Uh, he's been going a lot of Roy today, going a lot of his other characters. I remember seeing, uh, I believe it was at uh, a previous bracket where he was going, uh, this week where he was going a little bit of Link. He's trying to experiment a little bit more outside of the Rob, which I respect. On the other side, Whirlpool Washing Machine, a.k.a. Tab Soda, a.k.a. yet another Yoshi main in New York. <laughs> uh, blessed. Uh, there's too many of them, but there's also so much to <laughs> the... When you're at a hub of a character's main, you get to learn a lot of stuff real quick. But on the counter side, Zamba gets to be real familiar with the Yoshi matchup. And that involves really getting uh, good hitboxes at ledge to dissuade air dodges to ledge. Thus, taking Yoshi's jump and getting those early kills. Yeah, I mean, that's what we're already seeing. And not only that, the fact that he's rushing down, yet still utilizing this disjoint so effectively. Okay, one of the risks of Roy in this matchup, and the reason why, you know, I and I, a few other Yoshi players don't think it's that bad, is that Roy does have to sort of get close. Uh, you know, you were seeing that this neutral layer, in order to get the best parts of the hitbox, you gotta be right up in Yoshi's face. Shielding that will lead to a really nice, meaty neutral layer, so, oh my god, ugh. Yeah, the problem with getting close, of course, is that Roy's wallet is up in your face. It is still a disjoint, which means it's going to largely beat out some of these large, but not disjointed hitboxes of Yoshi's as he likes to, as both of them like to be in scramble situations. I mean, Tab Soda doing a great job of finding these combos off of F tilt, but it just looks like Zamba is able to make just enough space to poke out with sour spots before he blows you up with sweet spots. It's great, great empty jump there. But the parry, yeah, very nice punish. That was great reaction because he shielded the first hit of neutral air and was ready to parry the second and down be out of shield. Uh, or out of parry, rather, is actually a pretty quick option. That's another thing in this matchup. If Roy isn't careful and isn't getting the sweet spots up the sword, Yoshi can armor through it for, like, it's just ad infinitum. Bringing in the Latin, and I see, and it looks like Tab Soda is starting to bring a little bit of the pain, making it up to 65, but I love that rushdown. Look at how fast Zamba just called out this dash back, called out this retreat from Tab Soda. We get to see some of their stage bands. Very nice in the corner there. Man, I, it's also worth noting every single one of those stocks were done in the corner. First stock was this edge guard with the down tilt. Second stock was jab back air. Third stock also jab back air. So this is the type of thing where state positioning matters. Oh. It matters so, so, so much. So, yeah, look at that beautiful edge guard. Uh, but now as we move into the next game, we don't see a stage swap at all. Uh, I think the triplats were banned, so it, you know, it kind of yeah. makes sense why we would end up coming back here. But the question is whether or not, you know, Whirlpool can make some adjustments. Ooh, that's one thing we hadn't seen the last game. No egg lays had been landing. So perhaps start adjusting the uh, style and the approach in the neutral. But the, the rising, like that sort of down air in order to get the auto cancel can be a really good tool. Oh, he's dead. And that's same. Okay, second verse may be and may end up same as the first because it Tab Soda, like they're going for so much uh, like good follow-ups and trying to get these kills off of edge guards against Roy, which is the way to play against the character. But one false move and suddenly, like Roy yeah. or Marth or Lucina, that down tilt is just so oh my God, it's dead. Oh. It's just spikes for spikes and spikes, all of them coming along. But Zamba is still surviving at this lead. Oh man, none of these kill moves are connecting, despite Yoshi's great air speed. Yeah, he's trying to look for a kill off of that. It's not happening just yet. Oh, he's trapped at the corner. You need another trap back here, buddy? No. Oh, are you? Maybe. It's <laughs> he's gonna, looking oh, for there it. it is. Oh, okay. not quite, not quite. Didn't get the right hitbox up that jab. It is, I mean, jab back here is definitely... Did he close? Oh, that was so smart! He, he buried the first hit back here and crouched to avoid the rest of them? That's the sort of thing where, yeah, this guy's played against Yoshi. Yeah, I mean... There's certainly plenty of them, but finally that upper out of shield, great against cross up, is going to close that uh, close that stock out. And Yoshi can certainly put on a ton of damage, especially once uh, Tab Soda will start to realize that these are the ways to punish Zamba and his uh, ways to get out of disadvantage. Zamba loves to throw out uh, the jump as well as the neutral air dodge and force that 50 50 constantly. One false move, though, and Roy is like, uh, Roy's just at your disposal. Yeah, he looks for that roll onto stage because if it actually worked out, he gained all this stage positioning. 
tab Soda right now. Oh, oh. that's not true. But that was good cr it, creative, at least. <laughs> oh, my backfire. There's a lot of air dodges coming out from Zomba off of those uh, combo starters. Uh, or, like, honestly, the kill setup moves. But great job right there. Going for that pivot forward tilt yeah. just to get that extra distance. Takes out that stock. Things are looking much better. Oh, much, much better for... Uh, for Tab Soda this time around. Yeah, trading off of Yoshi's up tilt, and I mean, at low percent, Yoshi will absolutely be winning that trade. Okay. Interesting yep. way to get out of shoot. Well, I think he went soon. for the jump down B because oh. it's really good. Jump, uh, double jump bomber right. comes out frame one, so you can eat a hit and then immediately get back down to the ground with the, uh, and possibly even a counter attack with the down B. Uh, we're right. starting to see more of that. It is risky uh, because, A, down B is punishable, but also, uh, if they do manage to, you know, so Roy can break armor pretty early if he manages to get like a solid, solid uh, re uh, hit in. I love how grounded Zamba has been playing. Like, while Tab Soda has Ooh. been finding a lot more grabs in this game too, I just, yeah, yeah, just run up and do it. <laughs> it's, it's spots like these that make it really interesting though, because you see Zamba and you see Roy, and Roy is most commonly known for these forward air chains, these big neutral airs, like all of these sweet spots into sweet spot combos. But when we get to watch the final replay, Zamba just spends a lot of time right like this. Just stand on the ground, make use of Roy's sweet spots in order for anti-airs, whether it be short hop up airs and Roy's great fall speed, or most commonly the pivot cancel F tilt, and in that case, forcing Tab Soda to blink before he did. Yeah, and when you think about risk reward, absolutely makes sense why I did that. Anyway, we actually have the counter pick coming out uh, from Tab Soda. He is going into uh, uh, the green Yoshi. It it's important. Be, it, it is important. <laughs> Listen, uh, he was a red Yoshi before. He was confusing himself with the red Roy. So. <laughs> that, honestly, I always say that the real Yoshi players will counterpick colors and be able to main the entire color cast. But anyway, honestly, I think it's working out because look at this. 87, oh, 96 percent on Zomba. This is looking pretty, and right there, armoring through the first hit of the down, of the neutral air, ends up converting it into that up air kill. Beautiful stuff from Tab Soda. That's the first time we've seen him actually manage to take a uh, the first stock. Ah, and missing that sweet spot as well keeps Tab Soda alive and keeps him just in a really great spot. Going for the up throw, okay, yeah, I, I respect like, it. I like the jab, uh, sorry, the uh, the neutral grab coming out from Yoshi. It's it's questionable at times, and Yoshi doesn't necessarily get that much off of uh, you know his grab, but it has a disjoint, and it does have a lot of range, so a lot of the times when Roy is like spacing jabs on the shield, like right there, for instance, you can just press the shield grab and they're not expecting it, the very least disincentivizes them from right. doing that. Finally finding a sweet spot on that up air line. Tab Soda have been doing a great job of just being able to force through a lot of these juggle attempts. And the drop through platforms as well are actually pretty sneaky. He's doing a lot of, a uh, very good job of mixing up the timing of how he goes through this platform, whether it be running off the side or just dropping straight through. And it's been, or jumping off in that case. It's been a great source of me to get out of disadvantage and also to find solid hits off of it just like that. Yeah, Zomba's strategies from earlier on not quite working out the same way. Oh, yeah, good roll right there. Uh, oh, but the, the sour spot on that forward smash is going to do almost nothing to Yoshi. Oh, I'm liking this. Oh, man, the shield pressure was getting better, but Whirlpool so was just able to chase him down. Yoshi's speed is just so good. You know, you manage to maintain pressure from so far away. Yeah, it's really calling into uh, calling into effect of how poor Roy's poking game can be at the sour spot ranges. Like Roy wants to either be in your face or be retreating back using that extra speed to force whips. But that sweet spot in between, or that sour spot in between, is rough. But the sweet spots. Far from it, <gasps> finding that back air, giving Zamba back the lead. That up tilt should have been the stock, but it's <laughs> missing that is really going to cost him. He might get a ton of percent to, like, right now. And I do want to also mention one thing that Zamba's been doing is going for down tilt, specifically because Yoshi's back air, one of the best kill moves he has in neutral. And the fact that he can just low profile it with that move is something that he's been showing off before. And I'm expecting to see more of it as this game goes on. But right there, back air actually finds its mark, and that's going to be a even stock count for the two of them. Let's see if, uh, oh, that was so cute. <gasps> it just keeps going. That was, he chased down both the jump out of hit stun and, or the jump out of hit stun twice over in order to find 
Now 76, this absolute storm of damage from Tab Soda and these quick grabs as well. Really exploiting the fact that Zamba has been conditioned to shield against so many of these aerials. So you're go I'm going to be able to find a lot more of these egg lays and a lot more of these standing grabs, which while they may not get lead to anything true, it is still advantage. Yeah, oh no, this is without a jump. Oh Ooh. man, great job just oh. recognizing the resource loss. And that's going to be Zomba taking the set 3 0. Oh. oh, sorry. Yeah, Zomba. Yeah. What am I? Yeah, yeah 3 0. Oh. <laughs> yeah. I'm sorry. I saw that. They looked exactly the same. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yeah. yeah they, oh, man. Great scout at air dodge. Yeah. Like, just so good. And it's like Yoshi in that position, because he doesn't have a jump, like, what can he do? He could have, if we actually, if we want to go back uh, to that replay. Yeah, to um, the final stock we go. The final stock we go. In terms of what he maybe could have done, it's like, oh, man. Actually, I was about to say, what if he had down beat? But look at this. Look at the exact spacing he would have been at when the down B would have been appropriate, right? So... Uh, he got the, it was over here, right? That he, yeah, so, wait. Let me go back 10 frames here. Like right here, right? This is the position where he wants to be down being to the ledge. And as you can see, well, actually, if we advance frame by frame here, he is right there. He only started to dash away, and there's no way you could react to that dash away in time. So the fact that he had stayed right there at the ledge in order to dissuade that down B, then fades back here. Yeah, and at that position, like, it's so hard because Yoshi can't really down B anymore. It's way too risky. Stalling with Egg is also risky. The only option, if you know that he's going to wait for an air dodge, is to just push no button, which is... <laughs> that's certainly risky. Yeah, that's risky in its own right, and it's hard to do, and that ends up playing like a timing guessing game. So anyway, great stuff to Zomba. And I love the fact that we have these replay features because we get to really go into the minutia of... When we see these stocks, there's a ton of underlayer that you don't know, don't see is happening happening when it's uh when it's just instant in oh, the yeah. game you know these players it, it ends up just being a whole wash a process but the fact that we can see oh wow there was that really clever bait to dissuade the down in order to set up for that kill yeah man that's three thousand everybody yeah that's a three thousand that's a three thousand everybody <laughs> but Need i completely agree more. not only with the replays but also with zomba and his ability to uh, kind of force uh, force punishable actions out of Tab Soda so reliably. Like, staying on the ground as he was so frequently kind of makes it seem that, yeah, fall, fast fall into neutral air dodge, that's a really viable option and a really solid, just generic defensive tool. But it makes you wonder, like, man, there's so many ways to get out of this need situation, and it's because Zomba was playing so effectively against the, at this short hop burst range that caught uh, Tab Soda off guard yeah. at the full hop back air. Yeah, I you know I do want to give some quick you know mention to the fact that uh, Tab Soda did really clean up his play by that game Absolutely. three. And one thing he was really doing was punishing the uh, the empty hops that would come out from because you know Roy as a character he's his rising neutraler is really good, but most of his other moves he wants to be landing with them in order to actually make them safer. 